start out here at the mouth of leaders but what we're going to be doing today is we're going to be heading across to the vernons and getting a heap of little like stripies and then filleting them and taking them out to the deep water and dropping them for some bigger cold trout and then we're going to steam them across to the Tiwi Islands where we're going to camp tonight. We've got some other people following us, there are two boats coming out of the creek now. There are the two people going to be following us, you might recognise Will. He won, he got a $10,000 fish in the million dollar fish competition. Yeah, we'll get across and get some fish. I'll probably lose the boat. Bloody coral sharp. On a popper. Yeah, on a popper. Jeez. Hey, I'm on the I'm on the coral bars at the Vernon Islands, just flipping poppers at this thing. So all the bait and that's coming over this shallowy reef area, and then going into this deeper reef. And that's where I'm putting this popper and getting slaughtered. Look at this guy. Look at him. Something. Got one. Oh, Sorry. good blue vein just dropped it. Oh, that was a good blue vein. That's him right there, he's a big stripy huge one. Oh that was big. You want it? Yeah. Oh, look at that, get on that. Oh, they're fucking big. Look cod. Them stripies here are huge. I thought that was a cod. Alright, so we're now moving away from the coral bars and we're gonna head over to the Tiwi Islands where we're gonna camp the night. So I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but there's sort of like a faint image of an island over there. That is the Tiwi Islands, and that's where we're going to be heading to camp tonight. So we'll catch us over there. Alright, we're at the beach. It's time, let's hop off at the beach and go for a bit of a walk around. I'll show you the beach. That's the beach there, we'll just beach the boat up on here and we'll hop off. Hey? We'll back it in shortly. I won't hit beaches just yet. Alright, we're gonna back the boat in. It's not as hard, but there's a heap of mud crabs in the shallows walking along beside you. That'll be boggy sand too. Oh no, it mightn't be. Alright, let's hop off. Oof! Jeez, it is boggy. Hey man. Have a look at the how deep it is. Yeah, all right. We touch a root to this tree. And, yeah, <gasps> ghost crabs. I'm gonna hunt ghost crabs tonight. Take you guys with me. 
This is where the old camp was. There's a new one down there called Butterfly Lounge, but we'll call this home tonight. How good's that old water tank? I'll set this up on the chest plate and take you around the beach. Let's go. Oh, look at him. What is he? Shoving a shark. Let's corner him and get him. Look at him, he's a big one. He busted through us. There we go. Got him. Got him. Oh. Look at this guy. Yeah. This is a show no shark, same as the one that Dad thrown it. This is a different one. Just him down. <laughs> Look at him. So this one goes off. Oh. Well, mate, it's all right. There he goes. Wood grub. Oh, yeah, got one. Look at him. You can see him out there running through the water. Just let this fella go. Hold my spear, please, Dad. Come here, brother. Buddy. Watch him. Right, put him in the water. There you are. Wait, hey, he's going for my toes. <laughs> Look at him. There he is. There's the bucket. Let's go get some water. Dad's been filling up the bucket with mud crabs. He's got a stone head out. I'm trying to reach further. What I collected earlier on, I went up behind all the mangroves and collected a feed of long bums. They're pretty much a snail, but you can chop the end off them and eat them. They're in this bucket here. Here they are in there. Like a sort of slug. See, that's them in there in the shell, put them bottom down in the coals and they swell out and then you can eat them. So we'll put these guys in the coals. Oh, you can put fish in there. That's that bait. Anyway, they're in there. We'll put them on fire and have a look at this. Boats are beached and the rods are out. We've got a shark and now that shark has turned into a curry which dad is whipping up right now. We've got the fire starting to go now. We just started that but have a look at dad. We just got this shark about 15 minutes ago. It's as fresh as it can be. So we just got it in, filleted it. Now dad's gonna make a curry for dinner and cook it on the fire. There was a big old croc over here. We could see him from the bank. Last time dad was here with Charlie, they reckon he came up the bank and they chased him away. And then that was the end of him for the night, but he's back over here. So we'll go have a look at him, if he's still there. Look at that, it's low tide, incoming tide right now. We're just catching all the fish that are coming in. There's been a big seagull that we've been feeding. The big fellow has been flying over, staying in that tree there. And then coming down and picking up bits of brim. Come on, mate. This one, my knees are Got him. Ah, you bit me. Hey, he's gonna bite you, that one. He's got his claws up. <laughs> He's not mucking around. <laughs> Got him. Ghost crabs. Have fun. Best bait. Let's go get some more. Day two. The tide's just come up and we've got the boat off the beach. So... Now we're going to wait for these guys to get their boats off and then we're going to kick out wide to some deeper water with a reef and drop some baits on that. Try and get some bigger reef fish. But... This is what happens when you put your boat too high on the beach. When you're beaching it, you've got to get it towed off by another boat.
broke the rope. Did it move? Now again that, have to wait for the tide to come up. Now we're going to try it with our boat and a bit of bigger rope. Try and pull them off. Let's see how it goes. Tie it off and get going. Snatchy. <laughs> <laughs> Back of me boat fell off. <laughs> Got him. Happy. get out there so the deeper water plan didn't really work out for us because the tide was ripping through there too much cracker night tonight so we gotta go back in and get some fireworks before they all sell out so yeah we'll have some fun tonight and the video with a couple of crackers going on Thanks for watching our video today. Don't forget to subscribe and you can also follow us on Instagram if you've got Instagram. So I'm gonna sit back and relax and watch Territory Day go on and we'll catch you guys in the next video. Excellent, that was a good one. Good work, Charlie.